Resident Evil. All right, so hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Blindly Play Resident Evil Code Veronica with Mio Xfu. Now you may notice that I don't sound like I'm in the best of moods right now. And you may notice. Ah, why can't I put that protective suit on and be protected from the freaking bugs? I mean, you'd think. Combat boots, that would be enough, but no. Anyway, you might realize that I'm not looking forward to what I have to do in this episode, because I can think of no other recourse. There's a giant spider upstairs. That giant spider has to die. Maybe. Maybe we can run past it. I don't know. We'll see. But we have to get a gem from Alexander. Well, Alexander dropped it. Let's see if we can't get it, shall we? I'm already uncaution. I'm out of health items because I... The only other health item that I have saved... Claire has. So... Now yeah, we got the gem anyway. Yeah, take the Alexander's Pierce. Now, and I'll take the gem out of it. Yeah, I'll do that too. The problem now... Is I'm not exactly sure how to get out of here without dying. Besides killing the spider. I'm not exactly sure how well that's going to work. Whoa! Whoa there, Mr. Spider. Careful there, you might hit someone. Ah! That's really gross, actually. That's super gross. I... This was a bad idea. A very bad idea. But the spider is dead. That's all that matters. Let's kill these spiders if we can. No, you know what? Let's get out of here because these spiders will probably go away. Hopefully they'll go away. Ugh. <laughs> that was not cool. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's drop off this gem, and I don't know how we're going to get Alfred's jewel. It's down, the, down in the depths of the base, and I can under I have a guess of how we're going to get down there, but hell if I know how we're going to get down there. Alexia's bosom is not open anymore. See? There's just the one at Alfred's finger. Come on, Chris. You're a highly trained professional. Just jump. <laughs> hmm. Oh, you know what? I figured out the puzzle. Alexia and I are like the two coin, two sides of a coin. 
it shows Alfred, or no, it shows uh, Heart Spade, AA Crown. I have a die that has all of those symbols and more. Of course, I'm not dumb enough to just look at it and, and be done with it. I'm going to bring it with me. Yeah, we don't need you. Knife. Okay, yes, I am actually going to keep you because... I don't know. it and if something happens right after this I want Claire to be able to have it so I'm leaving it against my better judgment we're not gonna make it much farther than this are we I'm gonna have to go back stock up on some healing items maybe leave the green herbs with Chris instead of keeping them for the the run away from Stevie Boy. Well, it's getting harder. <laughs> Not really. I've still got plenty of ammo. It's just that I can't get through this area without getting damaged. Being dumb sometimes. Alright, let's make sure. Alright. Heart, spade, a, a crown. Alright, so let's see. Where's the heart? Heart. So it's a, a crown. Heart. So, what I say? A A Crown Heart Spade. Hey, I figured out a puzzle. Good thing I burp. Good thing I brought it. There we go. Wow, that is much larger than I thought it was. I thought it was just like a, a die or something. Well, hello, Alfred. That was much easier than I thought it was going to be. I thought I'd have to, you know... Actually go down into the depths of hell to drag your corpse back, but just making sure. <laughs> yes. Well, he is already dead. I just wanted to make sure. And somehow he left a lovely corpse. You've done what many before you have not been able to. Good on you, Alfred. At least you did that much. That's a pretty nice ring, actually. Sure will. Alright, so we just go toss that in there and something will happen? Hmm. I have no idea what's gonna happen. I can't even fathom. Is going to open the way to uh, the progenitor Veronica's lair or something. The ultimate baddie. She 
she's somehow still alive. Even though she's she'd be like what is it, like seven generations back? We'll find out, shall we not? Shan't we? Wow, it sounds really artificial if I say shall we not. Ugh. Just in case. Just in case. Just in case. Well, I mean, we're not going to get an F. We'll make it through, but we're g probably going to get a D. <laughs> D for daring, C for charismatic, B for brave, and A is obviously awful. It's like, uh, it's like golf. It's the reverse of what you'd think. The lowest amount of points you can get, that's the better. How many more dragonflies are we going to pick up as well? Because we're up to like one and a half dragonflies that we can well, almost make. We need the centerpiece on this and but... Well, let's see what I don't know. I mean, obviously that painting's going to open, but... Aha! Uh -huh. I knew that much at least. But no clue, is it going to be Alexia's mansion reconstructed? No, just still, uh... Mansion area. It's like, uh, it just reminds me, it's like, uh, Martian Gothic. This, uh, terrible, terrible survival horror game. With three guys on Mars, and it's just like... You got wood paneled hallways and the like. It's ridiculous. I mean, at least they've got the metal sl sliding doors. Those still had wooden doors. Okay, I can't hear anybody. That doesn't mean any. That doesn't mean that nobody's here, though. Oh yeah, an electron microscope. Time to get our science on. Alright, this time, I'm not going to forget that there's an elevator there, because it shows me that there's an area below. Okay. So this is just more of the labs, then. I'm guessing this is more of a main area of the labs, though. Oh, another shiny. But I can open it with my gun. <laughs> All right, I can just use a button. It's an another dragonfly wing. See what what I tell you? I knew we were gonna get more of them. Can't make one and a half dragonflies. I mean, I'm guessing we're making one for Alexi and one for Alfred, but I don't know. Yeah, there's a large capsule. There's also ammo, which I'm trying to get. Come on. Was that all that there was to this room? <laughs> Some of these rooms, man, I'm telling you. It's like, what do we put in here? I don't know, an electron microscope, a wing, some ammo. Yeah, oh, wait, unlock the door. Where where does this lead out? Oh. Oh. This is where Claire is. Ready for the big reunion?
Ugh. With the slime covered doors? Claire? Is that you, Claire? Chris? No! Of course it's locked. The door won't open. Hey, is Steve with you? Get out of here immediately. Can you unlock it from the inside? No, I can't. Chris, there should be a self destruct system somewhere. If you activate it, all the electronic locks might be deactivated. <laughs> giving us the file that we already have. Oh, something seems to be caught inside. What? What's caught inside? Come on, open it up. Open it up. Open it up. Open it up. Chris, open. There we go. Oh, the security guard. Okay, that makes a bit more sense. Okay. <laughs> I must save Claire. Well, first we're gonna explore a little. Cause I have no clue what we're gonna be doing for saving Claire. I mean, I know that the, uh... We could activate the self-destruct up here, but there's more things that we can do. I haven't even explored any of the rest of the area that we just entered. Ah! There's the hollow in the shape of the dragonfly. Okay, I get it. Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. Alright, so. We're gonna finish this up. Finish this up. Maybe. Next time on Let's Blindly Play Resident Evil Code Veronica with Mio X Fu. And Chris. And Claire. And Wesker and Alexia. Alright, um. You know what? I'm gonna go a couple more minutes, actually. I wanna see, uh. If there is anything left back here. Because either there's a couple of rooms, or there's no rooms at all. There's like no rooms at all, and there's just a dragonfly body. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Decided to actually aim at him. I see, Chris. Glad to know all that police training is paying off. Well, I'm just gonna let this guy creep up on me. No big deal. I can take him. <laughs> Alright. So yeah, I'm just gonna check the rest of these hallways. Ah, more health items. Fantastic, actually. Now. Just <laughs> Just a room with a typewriter. Oh man, they're they're throwing all the items at us now. I need to find a chest. What the heck? They're just throwing everything at me. It's just like, 
Oh yeah, we're near the end of the game. Okay. <laughs> have some of the stuff that we could have given to you earlier. Eh, don't worry about it. Music stopped. Cutscene. Cutscene. I come in search of a cuts. Oh. It's a uh, replica of the. Uh... Wait. Blue sapphire has been removed. Oh no. Oh no. We've got more puzzles. I've got to get the blue jewel from the lion and uh, waste a lot of time putting them in there. Never mind, we might have two episodes left. Three episodes even if it's a long boss fight and evacuation, like, in two with the train. But we'll find out next time. After we check out Alfred's room, of course. Not gonna go right yet. just make sure that this guy is out of action and we'll be on our way. Seems like it. Yeah, he's good. Locked from the other side. God damn. Well, I guess that's it then. I'll see you guys next time. And we'll figure stuff out. I've got some stuff to drop off though, so I'll see you. Then. I'll see you later. Bye now. Heh. <laughs> ant base. I see what they did there. Queen ant. Ant base. Very clever. That's why you didn't do an Arctic base, Alexia. All right. Saved. Here we go.